Hello dear friends, I will ask you a question. What is the biggest discovery after insulin in diabetes? According to me, there is only one answer and that is continuous glucose monitoring. We launched the first continuous glucose monitoring device in India in the year 2004. And now I am with you with the most advanced continuous glucose monitoring device probably in the world with the highest accuracy and that is Libre 2 Plus which got recently launched at the Global Diabetes Convention JPF at Kovalam in Kerala in India. So, what are the essential differences between Libre 2 Plus and Libre 1 in India? Number one, it is highly accurate. The earlier one has a mod of 9.4 and the new one has a mod of 8.2 percent which indicates higher accuracy which also indicates a higher accuracy even in the hypoglycemic range. The second difference is this is a real time device. The real time indicates that the glucose is there in your mobile phone and this is a display. I need not scan. The earlier one I used to scan and this number is available and it keeps on changing every one minute and it is highly reliable. It is non-adjunctive means I do not require a glucose meter neither for calibration nor for making an insulin dosing decision or for a treatment for hypoglycemia. So, this can be used not only for people with diabetes. So, I do not have diabetes, but I am using a sensor for measuring and modifying the metabolic parameters and goals. And that is the beauty of reliable sensors so that you can match the numbers with the sleep, exercise, physical activity, stress and so on. The other difference is with Freestyle Libre, since you have to scan every 8 hours, people might forget to scan. But here, there is no reason that you are forgetting and there will not be any data gaps. So, with the earlier sensor, there used to be multiple data gaps when you are looking either at the Libre view or at the download. The other difference is alarms. So, in this app, I can program for the alarms and uh, the alarm can be for a low glucose, alarm can be there for a high glucose. So, the moment the glucose is 180 or above, then the patient will have an alarm and the same can be shared via Libre link up to relatives or friends or to the nurses in the hospital. So, the opportunities, uh, the possibilities are innumerable. So, there are limitless possibilities. The older Libre one lasts for 14 days. In contrast to the older one, the new Libre 2 plus, it has a sensor life for 15 days. So, we have a new sensor which is far more accurate, which is real time which keeps on changing once in every minute, which has got an alarm function and with no interferences to medications such as paracetamol, which can even withstand a vitamin C more than 1000 milligrams per deciliter, which does not interfere with the accuracy of the glucose levels and which keeps on changing once in every one minute and which is of pronounced benefit, not only in managing diabetes in those on insulin, but also in those on only oral agents those aggressively getting treated for pre-diabetes to prevent the progression to diabetes and there is one more difference. The earlier one has an approval for use from 4 years onwards whereas Libre 2 plus can be used from the age of 2 years onwards. Though in India there are multiple other sensors, many of them do not have an approval for use in pediatrics. So, an approval from the age of 2 years again reassures the 
accuracy of this device especially in the hypoglycemic range. Of course, all innovations comes with a price, but these innovations are meant to prolong the lifespan, to enhance the quality of life and it is absolutely essential that we have to integrate these life saving technologies in our daily lives. Thank you very much dear friends.